uh, lots of requests for this one um, puncture repair so I've got a puncture to do on this little 20 inch Carrera so I'll run through it with you so step one is obviously wheel removal so release the brakes which I've done a previous video on and then out with the front wheel eventually And then we've got the wheel in front of us here. Insert the tire lever under the bead, under the actual bead of the tire, like that. And then once it's in there securely, you can push around and seat the tire from the rim. So easy on, on, on these 20 inch wheels, you could just do it with the one lever. And then the rest of the way around, you can use your hand to unseat the tire. Then you push the valve out, pull the tube, leave the other half of the tire on. The tire doesn't have to come completely off the wheel. Out comes the tube. And then you have the choice of repairing that tube or the new one. In this case, got a new one here. They're not expensive. So, unfold it. Find your valve. There we go. Remove the cap. I tend to put a little bit of air into the tube, the new tube, before I start, but that's personal preference, to be honest. So I'll just give it a couple of pumps of air, just to give the tube a little bit of hopefully give the tube a little bit of shape so it's not completely flat and then back to your rim locate the valve hole which is there in goes the valve first like that and you work the tire the tube in to the tire all the way around make sure it doesn't twist make sure it stays which is a, one of the points of putting the air in is it stops it from twisting, it's always good to do. And then you pop your bead back on. Now this is a really, this one's going on really easily, but if it does struggle, turn the tire over and the side that you didn't take off, the bead that stayed in, just push it into the centre of the wheel all the way around. And it gives you a bit more leniency then on this side, a bit more movement with the side you're working on to uh, pop the bead back in. And now, because I've said it's an easy one, it's probably going to fight. Right, there we go, pop it in. Just check all around the tyre, make sure that it's seated into the bead correctly. There's no high spots. And then, attach your pump. Now pump up the tyre and as you go in, as you're pumping up the tyre, you can check just to make sure that it's seated nicely all the way around the edge of the rim on both sides. No high spots anywhere. Carry on pumping it up to the required pressure. Make sure you're written on the side of the tyre. And done, ready to go back on the bike. Just check again that that tyre's seated nicely all the way around the rim. If it isn't, let a bit of air out, push the tyre around onto the rim nice and firmly and uh, go again. But then once that's basically it. That's uh, all done and ready to go back on the bike.